Hi, so my name is Kaylee Hanacrat. I am a rising senior at Barnard and I have been working in the office, the office of residential life and housing this summer and I've been answering some of your questions on Facebook. Um, I might have Facebook chatted with some of you guys too. Um, and we've been collecting questions from you guys on Facebook actually about what, just about the first year experience and different things that you wanted to know about Barnard and um, we're going to be doing another series of interviews um, and videos based on these questions. Um, so we'll just have different office assistants of different years kind of answer these questions as well. So this is just, this is my interview. Um, so the first question we got was basically asking us to describe the feminist vibe and community on campus and um, with campus clubs. So for me, um, I really wasn't super involved in any kind of like, I'm obviously a feminist, but I wasn't really involved with any feminist groups on campus, but um, it's definitely kind of what you make of it, and if you want to try to find the feminist um, environment, feminist culture, like, it's definitely here. Um, there's some really great women's studies classes, there's great um, women's interest groups, there's um, different political groups that you can get involved with to um, work with women's issues, like Smart Women Lead at Barnard's campus is actually really wonderful for that. So it's it's really like you do have to like try to make it what you want it to be. It's like if you're not really into a lot of um, feminist activism or anything, then it's not really going to inundate you. But it's definitely here. You just have to like know what you want from it. So the next question we had was this is actually a hard question. What's the hardest part about being a first year at Barnard socially and academically? Um, for me, it was adjusting to city life. Uh, I ha I'm from a really small town in Ohio, and I had never been to the city before, so it was just kind of getting used to the different pace of life here. Um, people are constantly moving, and New Yorkers aren't mean like people say, but like you definitely have to like get get used to the city and like how fast paced things are, and then you're fine. But um, it's and in, in Barnard, at Barnard, basically what took me getting used to um, it's actually a kind of a nice thing in a way is that people are just so so supportive and like there's so much support from the faculty and from the Barnard community that I was kind of taken back by how like supportive everyone was and like my RA was super wonderful and like was always there to talk to and I like I wasn't like mentally prepared for that because a lot of my friends had gone to state schools where they didn't really know any of the administration or anything, and I mean, our during convocation we met basically every single dean, and we met the president at the time, and it was really great. And um, it was just it took a lot for me to get used to how close knit the community was, and like how much you're just automatically like sucked into this really great community. Um, the third question was um, about safety, like any precautions or tips, um, and par neighboring parks. Um, Basically, uh, when I first came here, I was super cautious. Like, I wouldn't really ride the subway at night unless I had, like, three people with me. It was kind of obnoxious. But um, in my past three years here, I've learned that you really can ride the subway just about any time. You just have to obviously be aware of your surroundings and not go into places that, like, are questionable. Like, in general, New York is extremely safe, and so is our campus. Um, I, I mean, I've ridden the subway at like 2 in the morning before, it's perfectly safe. Um, our neighborhood's very safe, like you can walk to Morton Williams or down to West Side at any time of day or night and you're completely safe. Um, I wouldn't really go into parks after dark, just because, I mean, there is security and they are technically safe, but, pe I mean, your safety at night is a bigger concern, so don't go running in parks at night. That's Kind of a given though um but other than that i mean if you have someone with you you're usually okay like if you're gonna go into an area that you don't really know that well just take someone with you it's it's kind of common sense um there's not any like real neighborhoods to be afraid of like harlem is a wonderful place and it's not as dangerous as a lot of people think um and barnard security and columbia security are really fantastic and they're always there and you can actually call um for a shuttle service anytime um, to take you home from somewhere in the neighborhood if you don't feel safe. So um, keep that in mind. You'll hear more about that during orientation though. So um, the fourth question we got is uh, on what are some jobs that freshmen might get around campus or in the city? Um, 
on campus, you'll, or once you get here, if you have a federal work study, you'll go to a jobs training session and you'll learn all about um, the Office of Career Development and the job postings they have there. And um, I mean, I personally have had a federal work study grant for the past three years. I've worked in the Business School Admissions Office, I've worked um, in the Political Science Office. And I know I have a lot of friends who work in like the library or they'll just, or they'll work in like the Office of Residential Life where I'm working right now for the summer. Um, they work in alumni affairs. It's, the Barnard store is also another option. Um, those are all uh, jobs that you can have. They're not necessarily just for work study, but work study students get priority for those jobs. Um, you can also uh, work with the, our babysitting agency, which is fantastic. And I have a lot of friends who really take advantage of that. Um, the Barnard Bartending Agency is also a wonderful option. Both of these you'll hear a lot about during NSOP week and they'll have orientations and things like that where you'll learn lots about them. But for now, um, those are just some ideas. And around the city, um, I've had friends who've worked in Starbucks because there's two Starbucks within six blocks of Columbia. Um, I've had friends work at like bookstores. I've had friends work at um, restaurants. It's Really, like wherever you feel like going to try to find a job, you can find a job. Um, there's tons of internship opportunities. Um, I mean, it's really like you just have to look around, and there's lots of things. But um, the Office of Career Development has a really wonderful website where you can uh, basically go and uh, like look through po job postings from different businesses and different companies, and you can find pretty much anything you need on there.